I'm from New York City. I'm a city dude. I didn't hike any miles when I first started doing the Appalachian Trail. I threw hiked in 2012, knew nothing about it. The only thing I knew about it was from what I read. And if you've read this book, Bill Bryson doesn't paint a pretty picture of the Appalachian Trail. So my friends thought I was too city-fied. My family thought I was crazy. And my brother, well, <laughs> he wanted me to carry a machete. I got there, couldn't put my tent together. Hikers are looking at me like, what's up with this dude? I couldn't get my stakes down, my, my tent stakes down, and this guy walked by with a rock, taps him down, looks at me, and, and just walks away. <laughs> I'm like, dude, you're a genius. People told me about this marker that's on trees, rocks, that I'm supposed to follow. And the rule is, is that if you're standing next to the marker, though it's called a white blaze, if you're standing next to the marker, you should be able to see another one. Not far, which is not true. Because it, it was so, it was overwhelming in a good way because I didn't have enough time to go to say, hey, why are you doing this, you're nuts. I made sure to stay positive, no matter what. Halfway through my hike, I decided I was going to write about the trail. The book is called The Unlikely Through Hiker, because I've never hiked before. I've never done anything like this before. The first time I hiked was at Springer Mountain. I was the only black person on the trail. And I wanted to share that experience, not having any experience, going out here and discovering this like wondrous activity. And people ask me, like, why do you think like, why isn't there a lot of like diversity on the trail? Why isn't there a lot of black people on the trail? My story is that I didn't know anything about it. This book wasn't here uh, to share it with me. Like if I saw this book when I was younger, I would want to know like, look at this dude with dreadlocks and you know, he looks different, he looks like me. Like, let me read it and see what it's about. And uh, I don't want to spoil the story for you guys or the ending for you guys, but I did finish hiking the Appalachian Trail.